North Korea has launched a nuclear missile heading for Japan. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has confirmed that North Korea has fired a missile at Japan. The launch follows yesterday's 64th anniversary of the armistice that ended the Korean War. Increased concerns had been raised that the anniversary may have led Kim Jong-un's regime to test fire another intercontinental ballistic missile, that experts have warned are capable of reaching the U.S. mainland. Express reports, the missile is believed to have flown for 45 minutes before landing in Japan's exclusive economic zone. According to Japan's chief cabinet secretary Suga. Japan's chief cabinet secretary says the launch is a clear breach of UN resolutions and declared Japan absolutely cannot tolerate North Korea's repeated provocations. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe confirmed the launch and is now convening an emergency meeting of officials to address the situation. The Pentagon has also confirmed that it has detected what it assesses was a ballistic missile launch from North Korea. North Korea is notorious for marking key events in its history with missile launches or similar acts of aggression. The most recent warning was issued by one of Kim Jong-un's key generals, who called on the North Korean military to wage dynamic struggle to bring final victory on July 27. Pak Yong sik the minister of North Korea's armed forces, carried on the threats and called for a nuclear strike on the United States even if Washington does not attack first. He said, if enemies misunderstand our strategic status and stick to options of staging a preemptive nuclear attack against us, we will launch a nuclear attack on America's heart as the most relentless punishment without warning or prior notice. Satellite images have also emerged showing that North Korea is not issuing empty threats. Grainy images, at first sight, lead viewers to believe the North Portal at Pungaira nuclear test facility, the tunnel site used for the past four tests, is in a state of vegetation, with little activity and low general maintenance. However, Experts warn it is clear the site remains ready for the warmongering kingdom to launch yet another ballistic missile test.